Hey guys, welcome to LumoVest. This video is part of our series on the most common investment banking technical questions. The question we're going to go over today is, how does a $10 increase in depreciation affect the three financial statements? This is a critical question. It's so important because it's the foundation of three statement accounting questions. Here's how you should answer it. Starting with the income statement, depreciation goes up by $10 which causes pre-tax income to decrease by 10. Assuming a 20% tax rate, net income decreases by 8. On the cash flow statement, under cash flow from operations, net income decreases by 8. But we need to add back the $10 increase in depreciation because it's a non-cash expense. And so cash flow from operations increases by 2. No changes to cash flow from investing and cash flow from financing so total net change in cash goes up by two. On the balance sheet, under the asset side, cash and cash equivalents increases by two, but PP and E decreases by 10 because of the extra depreciation, so total assets decreases by eight. Under the liabilities and equity side, retained earnings decreases by eight due to net income, and the balance sheet balances. That's how you should answer this question. Here's something really important. Anytime you get these how does this affect three financial statements question, you have to be thoughtful about the structure of your answer. Getting the answer right is the basics. You also have to prove to the interviewer that you can organize your thoughts into a very organized manner, like what we just demonstrated.